Welcome back, you guys. This is the Syndra. Continuing my EU4 campaign as the Aztecs. And we are mostly just colonizing at the moment. We've conquered everything we need to conquer over here. We are the superpower of the tiny nations, basically. Um, it was also suggested to me that we could potentially go ahead and get a conquistador and start uh, exploring. Um, so I could also get one from the nobles here. They need a bit more influence. Can I get them that 4% extra influence? I don't really want to pay for that. Oh. Mm. So 3 development gives you 0.5%. I guess I'll have to give you a bit more. Is there a good province for the nobility here? <sighs> nope. Um, I guess I'll just give him... Uh, let's give him the cows at least. Uh, salt, I suppose, that's fine. Actually, a 2 to 1 over here, that is exactly enough. So he's at 40% right now. So I could demand a Conquistador. And yeah, it's a 0 2 2 3. He's got 3 siege. Really? Let's go ahead and pay for our army. Oh boy. Yeah, I guess we are kind of running low on cash. But uh, how much money are we losing? Two ducats. Yeah, right now we're doing four colonies and we only have three colonists. So that's going to cost us a bit, but uh, it's fine. So I can't really do search hunt for the seven cities because I'm a primitive. So I'm going to have to do this manually. Well, you know, might as well. Let's just move along the coast here and see what we find. Let's go in speed four. Hopefully one of these colonies finishes before we uh, run out of cash. Okay. Uh, some of these natives might attack us. Oh, there's France. So there are more nations uh, finding stuff here. Let's take the Doom, get the admin. There are more nations coming to, not the New World, but basically the primitive world here. Ish. Ooh, wait, we got gold where? How much gold do we have? Wow! <clears throat> and all of this could potentially be gold as well. I have five, six fucking gold mines. Damn! That is pretty good. Oh, hello, who are you? And this is probably a uh, uh, native nation, right? The primitives, like us, I imagine. Uh, this is Osage. Can we go to war with you? We don't have a valid CB against you, but we can. We're three provinces away from you, so we could always just, you know, kill you when we get to you. So this is technically the Mississippi River uh, trade node. Wait, uh, let's see here. There is a map mode for colonial and trade regions. So this is all Mexico. This is Colonial Louisiana. Louisiana is very narrow, but then it opens up, like, massively up there. So, I think it's only going to be, like, one or two more of these. Ooh, what is this? Colonial Migration. So, 200 people want to go here, away from this one here. Okay, that's fine. If they finish the colony, I'll be happy. Let's go ahead and find these uh, primitives here. But then again, this is down here. I want to continue that one. A ruler will sacrifice some of his own blood to the gods. Nah, no, fuck off. I'll take the doom. Uh huh. So this is Chokta. They are willing to accept an alliance. Really? Really, really, really. Uh, let's see how big Chokta is. This is his capital. I found his capital right away. Let's find all of his uh, provinces and then we'll move down. I'm gonna see how many colonial... Oh, we got livestock. That's bad. Oh, another one up here. But we're getting some attrition, 2.1%. It's mostly just supply limit. Yeah, I did take 25,000 troops here. So this is the next one. And looking at the borders, there's no more here. Okay, let's go down. So we found Ili Miwek. 
He's got a lot of... He's got Ottawa, Miami, Saskatch, Susquehannock. Nobody wants to work. Yeah, let's go ahead and discover all of these nations if we can. Like, if I were to spy on you, can I steal your maps? Let's do that. Let's go ahead and spy on both of these guys and steal their maps. Pipil, Pipil has been made into a state. I'm thinking we finish this one as well before we move on. I don't want to go into debt. We had a fight with some natives. Looks like there's another nation up here. So let's go here and then up. Uh -huh, we found more crocodiles. We're moving into Florida. Uh huh. So what is this nation up here? Uh, this is Choctaw as well. Really? Choctaw is kind of big. They got at least uh, a few more nations here. Uh, a few more provinces here. Muskegee. Uh, we can finish uh, exploration ideas. I think I will do that. We can fabricate claims overseas in colonial regions. I don't know if that counts. Um, has no possible neighboring province. Yeah. It's fine. Okay, so this is Creek. Let's go back down here. Ah, uh, so we're finding a bunch of these American natives. North American natives, that is. There should be a nation called Miami down here. Let's move, keep moving down here. Uh, colonially, we are still in Louisiana. No, no, no. This is Louisiana. It stops. It's only these provinces here. And this is the Eastern Colonies. Eastern America. Colonial Eastern America. Just keep going, man. I'm kind of bummed that I can't automate this. Automate this. Uh, but it's fine. What is this? Uh, oh, there's another nation. It looks yellow. Is this the Spanish we've been looking for? Please tell me it is. Scotland! Ha! <laughs> we have the Western nations, and the first one we find, not Castile, not Portugal, not France, it's Scotland. The colonial powerhouse, and they just started colonizing down here. Okay, well, we're a ways off from getting there. But it's fine. At least we found something there. So there's no institutions that are spread here yet. There's just no way. Um, oh, we killed some more natives. It's fine. We got wool. Wool. Is that... That's too... Oh, it's so bad. You bastards, give me some good trade goods. I mean, I know I'm getting spoiled by all the gold we're getting here, but still. We should keep getting those, please. More settler increase. Yeah, just keep going. We can build some more stuff. Yeah, we're actually making money right now. Because I'm not colonizing too many things at once. Uh, looks like... There's a nation up here. Another one up here. Well, we'll see what we find. We'll move up. See what we find up here. Uh huh. So, let's move into this nation. See who they are. Um, excellent year. Oh, we got some manpower. Wait, we have wine? I thought that was only from having wine. Maybe it's cocoa? I don't know. But we have, like, all the cocoa in the world. Pretty much. Not exactly, but, you know, very close. This button is weird. Yeah, there's some more cocoa available down here. I don't remember what cocoa gives you for a uh, trade good bonus. But I think it's good. Yeah, let's go ahead and find everything here. So these are the Cherokee. Yeah. Recruited ministry, yeah, okay. What tech are you? 566? Six, six. Damn. You guys are gonna get creamed. 
by me. Uh huh. Okay, so. Steel maps requires 50, and we got discovered. Uh, okay. So, I have this guy here just maintaining his position. So, I could always call this guy back in case of whatever. You guys are actually becoming loyal, even after I enforced religion on you. That's kind of cool. Uh-huh. Ah, you got discovered as well. I need you to get to 50. Stop. Getting discovered. If I right click you, I should not I don't see Scotland. Maybe they have to finish because I know once you right click this, the, like the capital of the province of whatever nation you're clicking should appear on the map. But I guess they have to finish colonizing that. How are they doing? They're, uh, you know, halfway there, pretty much. Uh, this is just a river. I, I thought there was, was another nation. And we got winter. We're gonna get some more attrition in winter. This is Roanoke. So we're moving up the east coast here, and we did find Scotland, but seriously, there's nobody else? Oh, there is... No, I thought somebody had colonized this. I'm shocked. Why has nobody colonized Cuba yet? I, I, I'm, I'm kind of interested to see what's happening in Europe, seeing as Scotland is the number one person that colonized, started colonizing over here. Okay, so let's keep going. This is Delaware, I think. Wait, we can move here? No, this is Chesapeake. Okay, never mind. Let's keep going. And then after this should be New York, kind of. Uh, Unami. Is that New York? I think so. No, I think it's more further up. I think it's further up. Oh, a nation. Let's see what we find here. Who did we find? Ojibwe. Okay. Let's go here and then move across. Looks like there are a lot of nations up here. Oh, no, 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 keep going here. Poto Watomi, we got Ojibi. Uh, let's go across into this one. Looks like there's a lot of nations here, kind of tightly packed. Oh, so they either colonized this or they just moved. Okay, you just finished, so I can go ahead and call you. And we can keep going down the coast here. I did kill all the natives all the way down to this here. So, yeah. Let's send you over there. Uh-huh. There are a lot of nations up here. And the Conquistador died. Really? He's still black flag, though. Uh, I'll lose the money. Can you keep exploring? No, he cannot keep exploring. I have to call him all the way back? Ah, oh, well, we might as well. We gotta kill some natives down there. Actually, no, you have to go all the way down here. And then you stop being black flag. That's annoying. But we did explore quite far north. This should be colonial Canada, shouldn't it? No, this is still Eastern America. Really? Okay, okay. So how's it coming along, Scotland? They got fish. Oh man, that sucks. When you first start, start colonizing in the New World, and the first you know, trade good you get over there is fish, that's gotta suck. That's gotta suck a lot. Um... So we're going to finish colonizing this, so we have pretty much the entire Mexican trade node. Which is fine by me. Uh, maybe we should start colonizing up the west coast as well, just to get that. Let's go ahead and kill some natives all the way up to this guy here. So, let's go ahead and move. Let's go ahead and uh, kill you. Uh-huh, they, they migrated, so let's go ahead and kill you. 
and we lost a general. That's fine. No, that was a no. That was a an, an advisor that died. Improve relations. Sure. So we got these three cleared. There's one more province we can do down there. Let's go ahead and uh, get at least one province down here. Um, cleansed of natives. And then we'll move down and clear a bit further. Because we do have three colonists that can be working at the moment. And you're almost done. Which is fine. Prospering times. Hua Stek. Hua Stek. What's wrong with this pop out here? There we go. It's a 3 3 1 with cotton. Uh, I think it's like the only cotton we have over here, so. Trying to get that to be influential in our trading thing. Ah, uh, no, I worded that. Basically, the fact that there's only one of this is not that good. I think I'd rather just go for the tax. Yeah, most of the money from this province comes from taxes. Yeah. Just give me the base tax. Yeah, it's fine. Maybe if I was in India. I think India had a lot of cotton, as I recall. So this one is finished. Very, very nice. So this is a state like this. But we cannot turn this into a state. Really, so Honduras and Texas, we can't actually make them into states. But they still count as full core, so I can still keep colonizing. That's good. I was slightly worried there. Uh, prestige, base tax. No, base tax, always. Okay, I just fought some dudes and I have to fight them again. We'll do... Um, I don't know, we'll do at least... We can just move up the entire coast, that's fine. Kill all the natives. Uh huh. Gulf of California. Yeah, you guys are almost done here. So not only are we killing the natives in the province, they're rising up against us and dying as well. So we're just butchering a bunch of natives here. Base tax in return for money. In exchange for money. Please don't rise up. Here we go. Okay, now we can move on to Nicaragua. Nice. So we do have a lot of vision of the eastern coast here. I mean, I assume a lot of them start colonizing up here in like the Canadian corner there, where Quebec is. But it's fine. The fact is we have Scotland over here, and once we get along the coast here, he's also going to continue to colonize. I hope he continues to colonize and form a colonial nation. Because... If I want to take this land, I'd rather declare war on the colonial nation so that I can take its capital and then just kill all the soldiers when they get off the boats from Scotland to try to help here. We can gain innovativeness. innovativeness. Mm, they gain influence. We get unrest for... Yeah, one province. Or it might be one state. That's fine. Innovativeness is decreasing. I guess for holding on to Indonitivus, I'm having a hard time pronouncing this, uh, as a pr primitive nation is pretty difficult, I imagine. So this one finished. Let's go ahead and make this into a core and start colonizing over there. Thank you very much. Oh, look at this. We can steal maps. We can do Mexico. Ten provinces in Mexico. Ooh. Thank you very much. So we can see almost the entire Rio Grande here. No, we can see the entire Rio Grande. Let's take the uh, autonomy. That was very appreciated. Thank you. We can also see a nation over here. Very, very nice. I have to get my soldier right next to his in order to uh, steal that. So we did kill the natives in Nicaragua. But let's uh, do go a bit further south here. We want to try to get to uh, Panama as fast as we can. So, yeah. This is not costing us anything to kill these guys. So, we've cleared a path all the way down to Veraguas. Okay, let's send you back up north and we can keep exploring. Okay. Good, good, good. 
A beloved heir dies. So we can get a temple in Quetzmala. Let's see, how valuable is that? Uh, Quetzmala. It's a point one, yeah? Or I could get a 514 heir. No, no, it's fine. We get another heir, no matter what, I think. So, uh, we got naval supplies. What is with these horrible fucking trade goods? Let's build a temple. And a temple. We're out of cash, but it's fine. We're making five ducats. Wow, that's actually pretty good. That's actually pretty good. So, can I start annexing you? Um... They must have less than 50 Liberty Desire, but we can placate them and then get more a royal marriage. There we go. So, we can start annexing them very, very soon. Did you finish converting? Yes, you did. Thank you very much. We're going to go ahead and annex you. So, that's going to cost us... It's going to take us 10 years, and it's going to cost us 456 Diplo over the course of 10 years. So that's like 45 Diplo a year. Fine, we'll do that. Okay, okay. You know what? It's fine. Uh, let's see here. You have a federation as well. A new settlement. Base tax. Yes, give me the base tax. So annexing is going to take us a while, but it's fine. We can keep uh, exploring. Let's send you... You can just walk across everything. That's fine. If it's the fastest way, do that then. Yep. Sorcerer caught. Um... We don't really need to worry about our doom. We can have other events lower it if we need to. We kill a few natives and we don't take any casualties at all. We're just walking across the plains here, killing a bunch of natives. Teyas. Shouldn't that be Texas? Uh, colonial Mexico. Uh, education for the poor again. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> It's already dropped to point 0.3 before I got this again. It's changing by behind neighbors. Is he talking about my vassal? 776. Okay, they're actually ahead of us. These guys are 577, so we are behind them on Diplotech. Really? Okay. I suppose that's kind of interesting. Take this, and then take this province, and then move up. There we go. Oh, we're actually out of manpower. Okay, so let's change this a bit. Yeah, this is costing us a lot of money. So, I'll just have a 10 stack. 11 stack. That way we can one-shot any one stacks that rise up against us. Yeah, we can still one-shot the, the, the stacks here. That rise up against us. Okay. Oh, I should have done that sooner. I'm an idiot. But, you know, it's not like we desperately need our manpower. Connecticut, okay. This is New York. Yeah. And we're fighting a bunch of people on our way back as well. With our other stack. Okay. Uh, what is this? We lost our claims against Zeu. That's fine. Uh-huh. Come on. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, I found more of these. I thought I was going to one-shot. Oh, it's a two-stack. Yeah. Pissing off the natives is going to whittle down our manpower slightly. Uh, but it's fine. This is Penny... Penobscot. Are there any colonial nations up here? Queen Regency. And you are disloyal. Really? Really? I'm gonna recall this guy. 
Can we get this guy back? Oh, I actually have to placate you? Really? Bastards. Okay, they're loyal again. Come on. Thank you. Uh, let's see. We have 50 spy network review. So let's steal some maps. Northeast. 15 provinces. 17 provinces. Mississippi. Yeah, let's steal all your maps of Mississippi. Ooh, thank you very much. So we found Pawnee and Assiniboine. Whatever. Um, that's fine. Let's keep exploring. I don't know how much more we can see here. Okay, so they did finish this and they've started their second province. Okay, so we lost an advisor. Give me more Isle of Armies. That's fine. Do we want to go out? Uh, yeah, we'll go over here. We have Micmac. Yeah, so there is a crossing up here. We'll just keep exploring. It's fine. I wish I could automate you. Automate you. But, um... I guess it's not to be. Come on! You can do it. You can do it. Let's move across. So the only nation I've found so far is Scotland. That could give me an institution. Yeah. That's kind of disappointing. But they at least spawned close to us. I mean, they're in uh, Florida. But still, that's close to us. Compared to if they started in Canada, at least. All right, let's keep going. Uh, colonial nation. No, no, no. Natives. Oh, more natives. Ah, uh, this is kind of boring. Yeah. Can you imagine play, playing a colonial nation like this in a multiplayer game? That would be so, the dead... The, the amount of dead time you'd have there is ridiculous. There's just not that much going on here. Once you've conquered everything here, what do you, exactly do you do? I mean, finishing our reformers was a bit of a challenge. I mean, don't get me wrong. It was, uh, it was actually kind of difficult. But um, now that I've done that, I'm just sort of sitting on my hands and waiting. Waiting for somebody to come find me. So this is Quebec, I think, if I remember my geography right. It should be like here-ish, somewhere around here. There we go, Quebec. Oh, we found England! This is our second nation. And they've adopted Anglicanism. So let's see, institutions. You got colonialism, renaissance, and feudalism. And the printing press. That one has spawned, right? It did spawn in Berlin like 23 years ago. Why haven't they gotten that yet? I think I'll just go back right now. I don't think I need to explore that much more. And we can actually go south and explore. Let's go back to Mexico City. Okay, so we did find England up there. I mean, they took Quebec. That might be a mission for them. I don't know, actually. Like, uh, British Canada? Is that a thing? I thought it was French Canada. Uh, Splendor. Um, we don't have any ships. We don't have any mercenaries. We don't have any ships. <laughs> I guess I'll take this one. I might, maybe... I can potentially get some mercenaries if I want to. So that one is not completely wasted. You got discovered. God damn it. Uh, okay, if I go ahead and spy on Scotland, how's that going to go? Spy detection in Scotland is 18.3. This one is 14.8. Okay. So we can do this one again. Okay, so we can also get some monarch points right now. Let's do that. So this one was useless for us. So let's just seek support for the clergy and get the admin points. Call Diants and get military points. Monopoly Charters, New World Charter, and give me this. And good! We can actually grab Military Tech 9. 
Well, you know... We don't have to. Look at unbalanced research. Looks like we're making money right now. Okie dokie. You guys are growing. As fast as you can possibly grow. Uh, I think we're going to have to wipe these guys at, out at some point here. They lose 10 loyalty and become disloyal. The merchants... Uh, no, no, no. The, uh, the, the clergy, on the other hand, I can pay off with money. I picked the wrong option! Oh, fuck. I thought I... It's the names of the estates. They're not called clergy. Ah. Damn it. I was gonna buy your loyalty with uh, money. Oh, well. Let's recall you. Let's spy on this guy here. Because we do want to wipe him out. Oh, we just got some doom. We have to go through this guy, I think, to get to Scotland. So, once we're close enough, we can try and uh, get a CB on him. And we're going to have to fight the Creek, Shawnee, and Wichita. And then Shawnee is both here, and so is Poto Watomi. So, you have a bunch of allies that I can't even see. And the Creek just moved. Ah, uh, and he left no forwarding address. Aww. But let's go ahead and pause it here. So, we have explored quite extensively up north. I'm thinking about going south this time around. See what we can find there. And we are moving, creeping all along the coast here. We're going to have to get to New Orleans over here. And it looks like we're going to have to fight this guy if I want to get through him and to Scotland quicker. Because if I have to go around him, that's going to be a pain in the ass. But then again, these guys might migrate to somewhere else and then just leave me alone. Maybe. We'll have to see how that goes. But anyway, I will see you guys in the next episode. But until then, see ya. And thanks for watching.